around that because uh, look at all the eyes. Right here, right here. Look out. Two, three. Huh? Two. You feel better about it? I need to smelt one up that way. That didn't take long. I've seen them on windy nights. Me and David Haynes was hunting one night and like his dog treed and one of the, the coon that was up there was in the top. And I mean, it was moving like seven, eight foot when the wind would blow. It, it, it was like it was just hanging on for dear life. And after storms and treat them, and they'd be like one night we treed three up, up one tree and they was just, it was like they was all bundled up and, and the limbs was just, you know, moving a lot also. So I've seen where you, you see a coon crossing the road and turn, I, I've heard I've got several buddies that has told me the same thing. Like they watched the coon cross the road and go up a tree and turn around and, and turn the dogs loose. It's like they didn't leave a scent. Uh, so I'm sure the wind affects it also. <clears throat> I don't know if we'll be able to hear him real good right here because he's around the, the bottom of the hill. He, Took a left. And let's hope he trees pretty close around that because, uh, yeah, there's, uh, there's not many roads in there to him. Four or five. Right there they go. Look at all the eyes. Right here, right here. Look at them. Two, three.
You got a hold of you? Huh? You feel better about yourself? Huh? Preacher, you feel better about it? He got bit, didn't he? Huh. <laughs> He's not a fighter. He's a lover, not a fighter. That is a monster. I don't know how much it weighs. It's a big one. That is a big one. Mm. Goodness. It's all right. Hey, my ears are my most sensitive part of my body. He got his ears pierced. He sure did get that ear pierced. Come on. There you go. Come on. Come on. And go ahead and click the like button, the subscribe, and ring the notification bell. Thank you.